गुड इवनिंग गाइस वेलकम बैक माय चैनल एंड दिस वीडियो इज स्पेशली फॉर एयू स्मॉल फाइनेंस बैंक एज यू नो दिस शेयर इज नाउ ट्रेडिंग इन द रेंज ऑफ 900 एंड इट हैज इट हैड अ ब्लास्ट टुडे अराउंड 10% यू मे यू मे थिंक यस गाइस द रिजल्ट वाज वेरी वेरी गुड एंड दिस शेयर इज जंप बट यू यू आर नॉट नोइंग दिस फैक्ट्स आफ्टर सीइंग दिस वीडियो गाइस यू विल बी अमेज्ड टू know this facts and i hope it reaches uh, thousands of people and all would gain the knowledge about this share so guys before starting this video there are two requests for you guys see this video fully so that you could get the knowledge and share this video to your friends so that they could also get the knowledge and the last thing if you like this video then make sure you click the subscribe button below so that you could get our latest updates and what not guys so moving on This is about AU Small Finance Bank. This is an investor presentation. It is given to you guys, and you see, they are giving that our strength. What they are saying means, this is a comb. AU Small Finance is a combination of NBFC as well as a bank pool. So both of them put together, as you can see in the circle, AU Small Finance Bank is occurred. And if we moving on, the contents here we are going to see here are. the q3 performance retail assets brand balances or i think the six things we are going to give you the important crisp content so that it could help you a lot and i'm sure that you will be very very amazed after seeing it guys the first thing and the key updates of this result they are giving they have said that they have acquired nearly 1.4 lakh new customers I mean this within this 9 month or the quarter third results they have acquired around 1.4 lakh new customers and now it is totally around 1.6 million customers totally and if you see that they have powered more than 76000 vehicle which means vehicle loan and 13000 small business loan to businesses and 1400 homes housing loan and more than 12000 and personal loans in december quarter 19 is served guys and they have said that first ever digital brand campaign on hotstar guys oh my god on they have generated more than 1.4 crore video views i mean they are saying that they are the first digital uh what is the digital advertisement to give this type of brand campaign and also this is the main thing they are stating that and uh, as you see that they have added new 16 branches in this third quarter result guys and investment is 525 crores from camas holding for warrants convention so this is a investment type from a big company and if you know that the advances growth advances mean the loan disbursement the loan asset under management grew 37% year on year to 29867 crores in which retail share what is retail I mean the normal individual customers they are having growth rose to 81% this of is 77% if it, that means previous year it was around 77% this year is 81% and loan loan disbursement has been improved to 23% year on year share on retail loan and exposed to nbse strings further now around to 7% as per the management and uh, it is a slight good but uh, good thing guy guys and so you know that the despite slow down and daily npa tagging gnpa gross npa and net npa at 31st december improves to 1.9 and 10 respectively this will i will put this clearly in the down graph guys and now total deposit is around 23865 crores guys if when in the year on it is 63% jump year on year and 8% quarter on quarter and casa ratio is are is maintained at 17% stable guys and they are given a new person has been employed at and uh, he is a director he has been serving in the state bank of india and they have achieved uh, leverage position and unbanked rural centers from 29% against the requirement of 25% super guys and uh, adequate capital crar is around 19.3% or 16.5% and uh, This is the Golden Peacock Award they have earned for risk management and special. This is a special awards they have earned, and this is this comes. Uh, there comes the important thing. They have 11 states, but yesterday, Ujjwal Small Finance Bank had in 22 states. 
that is a difference and they have 15.9 lakh customers totally and 15,000 employees and if you see total balance sheet asset from 27,800 crore within a year it has jumped from 27 crore to 38 crore that means 10,000 crore improvement guys and loan asset under management they are I, I sold no guys A L loan A U M it has jumped from 21,765 crores to 30,000 crore and deposit also and CASA ratio is around 17% they have given that and if you see the total income, total income, if you say compare 9 month financially, it is around 48% jump as you can see here. And also any other things, as you can see here, healed on asset under management, cost of funds is very, very important guys. Cost of funds has been reduced from 79 to 7.8% and uh, NPA, oh my god, as you can see here guys, from 2.1% is now 1.9%. Now you are saying that uh, just a 0.2 percent, you know, guys. For for 100 percent, it is 0.1 percent. If you multiply with crores of amount, then you will know how much they are reduced. And provision coverage ratio also, uh, it is uh, stabilized. And uh, consistent probability that earning return on assets ROA, it is around 2.1 percent. And other main things, what to note, guys. And other income has been a constantly stable position and cost to income ratio in Q3 FOI 19 it is 60 percent 60 percent guys cost to income ratio now it is just 53 percent there has been a 7 percent reduction in it and uh, other income they have given breakup of other income guys so that you could get it a knowledge. As you can see the other income it is I mean loan proceedings other fees are going 80 some course that is the maximum thing they are gaining and moving on ROA return and I mean ROA return on assets they are earning around 3.1 percent in retail assets and uh, 1.7 in small and mid corporate asset total loan comes to 2.8 percent and uh, stabilized stable asset quality they are maintaining guys and the main thing will capitalize they have already said the CRAR as you can see here December 18 the tier 1 CRAR is 15.5 percent now it is 16.5 percent see the difference guys and uh, profit and loss statement as you waited here guys as you can see the interest earned is 1100 crore and the interest expenses uh, they have done is 605 crores so net income coming around 500 crores and other income 161 crores if you see the main thing is known as the provision guys you should see the provision okay guys it is it had been a slight increase in provision but if you compare the amount of level of loan given and interest earned the provision percentage is less guys and uh, the total profit is coming around 200 crores for a round of year previously it was 95 crores as you can see here 95 crores now it is 190 crores so the balance sheet totally they are giving and this contains the share warrants deposit borrowings that are discussed above and this is the very 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 important thing these are the manicure shareholders which means big shareholders who have invested in this guys and you can see here I will zoom it carefully as you can see here promoter is holding 30% domestic institution 15% Individuals domestic 8%, other domestic 3.5% and foreign investors. Who are these big investors guys? As you can see here, Redwood Investment 6.9% holding and Kotak Mahindra Mutual Fund guys 4%, Namura 4%, Motilal Oswal uh, having 2.4% uh, and SBA is holding around 1.8%. Vanguard, what is Vanguard? Vanguard is a uh, American mutual fund company or an investment company it is holding around two percent and uh, Motorola also is holding 1.1 percent so guys uh, putting totally what we have seen in AU small finance bank is absolutely amazing guys and now it is a small bank it has a future capability and it will grow future it will grow in future a hell of a lot of and higher we are positive on AU small finance bank the one and only reason which is avoiding us go to invest in this price this price is very very high I mean as you know the results was good but therefore it has jumped around 90 rupees today but if you have any correction if you have any possibility of correction then it will be the better choice to go and acquire a small finance bank now if you ask me whether I can I go over acquire 
उज्जवल स्मॉल फाइनेंस बैंक और ये यू स्मॉल फाइनेंस बैंक I would refer all to invest in both banks because both has a different level of workout. Both banks is not same. Even if one bank come down in the profitability, the other bank could do the could give the gain, guys. And we are positive on both these bank. If both these banks governance issue is already good and uh, corporate working is also good. If this thing is continue and this profitability continues, we are sure that a hell of a lot of profit would be made by this both the banks. And congratulations to the investors who have invested this stock. And thank you to all who are seeing this video and see in the next video so soon, guys. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button below so that you could get your latest updates. Thank you, guys.